All right, welcome to Food Truck Party VBS, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> all right, oh, wait a second. Welcome wait a second. Food wait Truck second. Party VBS. I don't think everybody. that was loud Good enough morning. at all. Good morning, everybody. Awesome. So, welcome to Crystal Springs Good United Methodist morning, Church. Everybody. If it's your first time here, welcome. We're happy to have you. Awesome. Um, I'm Delina Dubos, the so Children's Ministries Director, and, and I want to say thank you for trusting us We're with your precious you. little um, ones. I'm we have Dubose, enjoyed this weekend Ministries so very much, and they have and been an absolute joy, and I'm not kidding. I mean it. They have been really, really well behaved and very good. So I'd like to introduce to you our new pastor, David Shoemaker. Let's give him a warm hello. Our new pastor, David David Thank you, Delina. Um, hey, Jana, we've got some feedback. It's like the live stream is re. You um, hear it? Hey, it's it's Jana, it's replaying back feedback. here. I don't know it's what's like going on. Maybe it's me. Is... It's an awkward moment. It's the thing we do. It's just fine. Um, we are so glad you're here. If you are have brought your children uh, for VBS and you're not normally a member. Uh, Come to Crystal Springs UMC. Thank you. It's just been a joy to have your kids here, and uh, we're so grateful. We're going to have a moment later to thank our leaders, but we are grateful to you. Um, we have got a couple of things coming up. We have a fish fry this afternoon at Lake Kapaya, and I have a very brave soul who is coming forward to tell us a little bit more about that. He's coming down right now. He's coming down. Here we go. That's from 5 to 7 this afternoon. And tell us just a little bit more. Well, you all know we're having a fish fry this afternoon. I want every one of you, kids, adults, everybody, to be at the fish fry this afternoon. We've got some good fish to cook. We're going to fill everybody up on good southern fried catfish. The Blake pool will be open for the kids from uh, 5 to 7. They will have a lifeguard there to take care of your kids while you'll go out and eat all the fish. So, as you all know, we combined our summer picnic and our fish fry this year into one thing, and we're having the fish fry today. So, y'all, please come out and enjoy the catfish this afternoon. We're looking forward to a very good time. Great. Thank you. And I've been told that the pool is open to us from 5 till 7. Not like 4.45 to 7.15, but from 5 till 7, I was told to make that very clear. Uh, another announcement is many of you have a flat Jesus, and you've been taking Jesus everywhere with you when you go on vacation, when you're at the pool or at the beach or up in the mountains, wherever you happen to be. Take a selfie with flat Jesus and send that to Julie or to Jana, and I've not done that yet. So Isaac, where are you? Come up and help me. Here we go. So that is all you have to do. I, I'm going to go to annual conference, and kids, I'm going to see if I can get a picture with the bishop and flat Jesus. Would that be kind of cool? Be really cool? That would be really cool. So we'll do that. Well, thank you for being here. I am going to turn it back over now to Delina. All right. Thank you so much. All right, guys. So we are going to have our first song, and I did promise the first graders that they come up on stage to dance it. So you guys come on up, just the first graders, come on. I promised them yesterday we didn't get to it, so I try to keep my promises. Here we go. But we want everyone to get up and dance with us, okay?
this week, exploring how we experience God and how he provides for us our daily bread this day and every day. Right, kids? Yeah, that's right. My name is Top Chef Pam, and this is my friend, DJ Cupcake. Hey, everyone. Thank you for allowing your chefs to join our VBS this weekend. We had a great time learning new things together. We sure have. What's been your favorite part, DJ? Favorite? Um, uh, meeting our friends recession, um, watching our, our, our leaders act out stories from the Bible, or, or, or those awesome food truck party tunes. Yeah. Learning all the ways God provides and, and how daily specials fit together to make up one awesome mealtime prayer. That's there, there's not one favorite. Um, what about my jokes? I mean, you know, I know you enjoyed those. Wouldn't well, you like for me to share just one more? Uh, okay, sure. But, but just one, really, they're not too bad. And I've even acquired a taste for them. Uh, Go okay. ahead, okay. share one of your jokes. All right. Why was the baker grumpy? Because uh, he got up on the wrong side of the bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Oh, my. Well, I, I love learning and sharing our main course theme verse with them. Oh, that's a good one. Our main course has helped us keep focus and to remember what we've been about here at the food truck party. Matthew 6, 11, let's say it all together. Give, Give us, us this day our daily, daily bread. bread. Matthew 6, 11. Good job. It's part of the Lord's Prayer. Do y'all remember that part? That's part of the Lord's Prayer? Yeah. And every time we say this verse, we're remembering that God provides for us every day. I love that. I love it. I love it. And you know, you know what's better than saying our main course? What's that, DJ? Singing it! Ah! <laughs> Can we sing our main course song to help all of our guests learn it? Great idea. Would our music leaders come up and help us? Yeah. Come on, guys. Where's our leaders? I need y'all all to come up and help us sing. Everybody shout. Yeah. Our Father in heaven. Our Father in heaven. How awesome is your name? How awesome is your name? Your kingdom come, your will be done. Your kingdom come, your will be done. On earth as in hell. On earth as in hell. Give us this day our daily bread. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive our sins as we forgive. Lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. Oh 
Father in heaven How awesome is your name How awesome is your name Your kingdom come, your will be done Your kingdom come, your will be done On earth as in heaven On earth as in heaven Give us this day our daily bread Give us this day our daily bread Forgive our sins as we forgive Forgive our sins as we forgive Lead us not into temptation course, this one right here, chefs also learned Bible stories and daily specials. Daily specials were phrases that helped us to learn to remember that God provides for us and that we can help by providing for others. Um, our chefs and volunteers are going to tell you more about that. I'm going to let Miss Delina come on up. Yay! Y'all give her a hand. She's worked so hard. Woo! I love Miss Delina. Yay! <laughs> All right. Thanks, Top Chef. Okay, so first we're gonna have we're gonna have these three chefs come up. We're Emily, come on up, Graham, come on up, and Levi. All right, so they're gonna share their session one, what they learned during session one at VBS. Our first Bible story came from the Old Testament, the Book of Exodus, chapter sixteen. We learned how God provided quail and manna to the Israelites in the desert. By understanding that God can, can provide in any situation, we learn that God is great. That's why our daily special for session one, God is great. Let's all say it together. God is great. Great job, thank you. Our chefs had a great time learning about being on a roll with God. And here are some of our favorite memories. Come on, everybody. There's something that you need to see. A whole new way of living. That comes by faith when you.
Fantastic. Um, we have had some wonderful people who have helped to make this happen, and I'm going to invite up all the leaders and volunteers, everyone who has assisted us with Vacation Bible School. If you helped set up, you built something, or you were just helping lead, now would be a good time to come on up. We want to say thank you. Y'all come on. They have been sharing the Word of God this week with all of these wonderful children and with others. Come on, y'all. Delina's calling you out. Yeah, come on. Don't be shy. It's okay. You're fine. You're fine. That, that's... Okay, all right. Well, that's fine. It's fine. Yeah, they did. They got lucky. Come on. Wow, look at this group. Fantastic. And yes, there are more, but it's okay. It's okay. Look, we're going to be here forever. I won't fish tonight, so come on. Um, we want to thank you for the work that you have done to make VBS this year such a success. And by staying on a roll with God for guiding our children to turn to God for all of their needs. And on behalf of the congregation, I want to say to you, thank you um, for, your, uh, for your time, your talents, and your service. This is your part. During VBS, chefs discovered daily specials, parts of a memorable mealtime prayer that reminds of us of our God who provides and of our invitation to join God in providing for others. 
Let's say the prayer together by repeating each phrase after our leaders. Let us pray. Gracious God, thank you for letting us experience your provision so we can join you in the mission of providing. May you always guide us as we live out your mission. Thank you for your son, Jesus, who showed us how to follow your active plan for our lives. Help us to look for ways to share your love with others. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's give them a hand. Now we're going to have a sharing from session two. So I need Walker, Rossum, and Emma Love, please. Walker. In our last session, we learned a Bible study from John 21, when Peter and some other disciples go fishing after Jesus died. After a night of catching nothing, a mysterious stranger, who is Jesus, suggests they try fishing from the right side of the boat. The disciples catch 153 fish. After feeding the disciples a breakfast of fish and bread, Jesus asks Peter three times if he loves him. After each time, Peter says he does love Jesus. Jesus invites Peter to feed my sheep. From this story, we learn how God has given us all the call to love and care for God's people, or be my sheep. And we learn to trust God to provide what we need from day to day to carry out this work. And our daily special for session five is give us, Lord, our daily bread. Let's all say that together. Give us, Lord, our daily bread. Great. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to continue our worship now with the bringing of God's tithes and our offerings. I'm going to ask the ushers to please come forward at this time. Let's pray. Oh God, how grateful we are to you for your provision, how you constantly provide for us. Lord, as we bring now your tithes and our offerings, we ask that you will take and use these for the advancement of your kingdom. In Christ's name we pray, amen. The splendor of the King Clothed in majesty Let all the earth rejoice All the earth rejoice He wraps himself in light And darkness tries to hide And trembles at his voice and trembles at his voice how great is our god sing with me how great is our god and oh see how great how great is our god and age to age he stands and time is in his hands 
beginning and the end, beginning and the end. The Godhead three in one, Father, Spirit, Son, the Lion and the Lamb, the Lion and the Lamb. How great is our God, sing with me, how great is our God, and oh see how great, how great is our God. Name above all names, worthy of all praise. My heart will sing how great is our God. Name above all names, worthy of all praise. My heart will sing how great is our God. How great is our God. Sing with me how great is our God. And oh, see how great, how great is our God. So at VBS, we don't simply want to hear about God's love. We want to share God's love with others. So our mission, this VBS, was to, to, uh, to collect canned goods and other non-perishable foods for our very own SOS food pantry right here in Crystal Springs. It's located at 308 Harmony Road, and I hear it's been around for almost 30 years. Um, that's as accurate as I could get the number. Uh, distribution is the second Monday of each month from 9 to 11 a.m. So if you know anyone that's in need of using the food pantry, let, please let them know that. So if you've brought any donations, we've, we've got to a, off to an awesome start. So let's see how we can finish this off. If you brought any donations today, please bring them up. And if you forgot or if you, if you already brought some, Miss Sandy has some extra for you to bring up for us, okay? Come on, guys. Grab from Miss Sandy. Put it there on the table. Awesome. Thank you. Right here. Awesome. Whoa. Thank you. Okay, yep, you leave that right there. Awesome. Whoa. Right here. Yeah, you put the whole bag. Wow, guys, this is amazing. The pyramid, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Amadine. Jolie, right on the table, right there. Can you put it right on the table? Beep. Hold on. Let's do right here. Right here. Right here, right here, back there. Look. Thank you. Thank you. Is that everything? Awesome. Big round of applause. These kids cleaned out their pantries and went to the store and everything. We are so very grateful. And the people that who would be benefiting from this food are going to be very thankful as well. So thank you all so very much. And think about the SOS food pantry throughout the year. Okay. When you have a little bit of extra that you can give, you can go ahead and drop that off there. 
All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of reflection time to talk about what the kids learned at VBS this weekend. So chefs, that's all the children, chefs, we listened to the story from the book of Exodus of God providing manna and quail to the Israelites in the desert. Did you imagine what it must have been like to see that manna on the ground every morning and those quail, watch the quail fly in every night in the camp? What does it make you think about God's greatness? Luke, what does it make you think about God's greatness when you think about how he provided the man and quail for the Israelites? You don't, yes, you do. Yes, you do. That he could do anything, right? He can provide anything that we need. So our daily special for this session was God is great. As we think about the story, God provides man and quail. It's apparent God truly is great and wants to provide for God's children. Miss Lindsay was our Bible Adventures leader this, this year. Miss Lindsay, will you come up? And she taught the kids some sign language. First one, so I, um, here. I need my hands. <laughs> all right, all right. Do y'all remember any of them? Who remembers? Let me say. Stand up. Let's do. Let's do the three-word one first. God is great. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. God is great. Awesome. Awesome. Congregation, let's do it. You're going to bring your hand down like this, and then you're going to put your hands up and push it forward. Cool. Ready? One, two, three. God is great. Awesome. Awesome. In yesterday's session, when we listened to the story of Jesus cooking the catch of the day, we see Jesus helping the disciples, feeding the disciples, and calling the disciples to action. Our daily special for this session was, Give us, Lord, our daily bread. The story of Jesus cooking the catch of the day shows God loving us through Jesus, but it also shows God asking us through Jesus, Do you love me? It might sound strange, but asking God for what we need is not just about asking God for something. It's also showing God our love of God and trust that God loves us enough to provide. What can you do after Food Truck VBS to remember that, uh, to ask God for what you need? Maybe you could do this. All right, do y'all remember the other one? Okay. Let me see. Give Lord daily bread. All right, awesome. So, congregation, are you ready? All right, so you're going to bring two hands, pinch them together, bring them down. Give. Holding your right hand in the air, we're gonna make an L. Put it on your left shoulder. Buckle the seatbelt. Lord. Okay? Thumbs up to your chin. Daily. All right? And now this one's a little tricky. So put your right hand in there. Cuff your hand. Put it forward like this. Left hand straight. Bread. All right, so now we're gonna put it all together. Are we ready? Set. On one, two, three. Give the Lord our daily bread. Nice job. Awesome. Y'all remember. Thank you, Miss Lindsay. Awesome. All right, so we're going to say a little prayer, okay? Everybody, prayer hands. Let's concentrate. Boys, concentrate. Prayer hands, right? We're going to pray. That means we're focused and we're paying attention to what we're going to say to God, right? Father God, when I'm hungry, Lord, when we're in need, help us to turn to you. God, when we see others who are hungry, Lord, when we see others in need, help us to turn to you. God, give us eyes to see the good we can do, and Lord, give us the hands to see the work. To see the work through. God, fill our hearts with your mercy. Lord, fill our minds with your great ideas to serve the people you created and the world you so love. Thank you, God, for each person in this room and each person at Food Party VBS. Thank you for Jesus, 
your Holy Spirit, and for daily bread. Yes, Lord, we love you, and we will feed your sheep. Amen. Hey, it's got a great beat, and you can dance to it. Thanks to all of you and our friends and family for a thrilling and successful VBS at the food truck party. Woo! Yeah! We hope you all had as much fun as we did. And Miss Delina, would you mind coming on up here for a minute? We love Miss Delina. Yeah, let's give her another big hand. I have a help helper somewhere. Someone? Yes, come on up. Miss Delina, this is just a teeny tiny token of our appreciation, of our love for you. Thank you. And we so appreciate the way that you love our kids and that you feed them every week with God's word. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Yay! Yay! Before we do the benediction, I do want to say a really, really huge thank you to our top chef, Miss Pam, Woo! and DJ Cupcake. Uh, DJ Cupcake is back there. Don't want to spoil the surprise, but I would like to take a picture with top chef and DJ Cupcake after the service. We'll make a line, and you guys could go up there and take a picture with them, okay? All right. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Let's stand now for our benediction. Well, you've been fed the word. You've been shared with. And now it's time to go and be the church and share with others. So in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, go now and be the church. Amen.